hello guys we made again now we will enter a new blended 3d series tutorial which is uh, I'm try I will try to draw a uh, modeling a uh, faucet model in this series tutorial we will um, running also about a uh, tilt and string and fatten tool feature also we will learn about quick fluid simulation but in this first video i'm just gonna show you how to modeling the pipe object first okay delete this cube object and change your viewport to front and then we will add a curve bezier tool click on align to view here so you will have this display and then next enter edit mode tab and choose your change this um, bezier object to vector so it will create <coughs> a strike line like this and next I'm gonna add another vertex by just adding I'm sorry Yeah. and then maybe grab change to vector again so basically I'm just edit the vertex and base here here And I also want to add another vertex between these two vertex, the top vertex here. So I press W for subdivide and then put number of cut to so now you will have a new vertex point and add another one here between these two so 
so sub side in and enter so now we have a small vertex here And now we will add a circle bezier tool. So it's just for a pattern purpose. So go to edit mode. Eh, I mean object mode and circle align view is too big so I'm just gonna scale it a little bit like this if you want your um, your pipe reduce this big so you can just change maybe like this the pipe reduce so and next, choose your Bezier curve and go to data editor here. And then for bevel object in geometry here, you choose Bezier circle. Here we go, we have our simple and easier pipe like this. So if if you're already happy with the result, I think it's it's okay. You are already happy. Can <clears throat> what else you can change the oh I want to make this part um maybe we will use a string or fatten feature so I wanna to make this vertex a little bit um, bigger so go click the vertex here and click on string or fatten here and now you can just move your mouse like here like this And then you also can choose the parameter type of a uh, pattern you want on active spline here. <coughs> so maybe it's like that. Next, you can just. adjust the vertex and it's the share like this
so basically you just play with the vertex here yeah. okay and then when also I want to give this maybe a string and fit feature to this vertex so oops oops I want to have a tail effect on this part of the pipe so what I'm gonna do is select this vertex and click tail and move your mouse mouse move your mouse like here like this one Maybe that is enough and the front view will have this this display and next we will add a solidify modifier here and then change the thickness value here to negative uh, negative 0 0.1 and now our pipe will look like this okay I think that's enough for now on next tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to add uh, the faucet handle on top of this part. Okay, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and I see you soon. Bye!